Hi, John with eTrailer. Hey, if you are looking to go off-grid, either on your cabin, on a piece of property, or even on an RV like this, check out this cool little kit from GoPower. This is the GoPower Overlander Solar Panel Kit. Now, the cool thing about this kit is it has everything you need to install this and start charging your RV and keeping it off the grid to keep your batteries powered up. You're going to have the three solar panels. You're going to have uh, the wiring. Uh, this kit works if you have a solar prep package on your RV or even if you don't. Uh, this one in particular, it did have the solar prep package. If you have a solar prep package, you're going to see the connectors right there. That's the connector plate on top and it was great. It installed fairly easily once we found where the leads were. Now as far as power rating goes, we're looking at 570 watts of power out of these three. Um, they're connected in parallel, but even with 570 watts, we're talking, we have a refrigerator downstairs that's drawing 300 watts. Um, and we have all the lights on, you're, you're still charging your batteries. On a day like this, you're, be, you're, you're able to use your refrigerator, use your lighting, and still charge your battery bank for the evening. Now these install in any configuration up on your roof. Um, you know, you just make it work. Wherever you have space, you can install these things. And that's what we did. We installed two in the front, one in the back. So if half the RV's in the shade, we're still charging batteries. So this is how it looks up on top. And we got a solar panel uh, down below that's regulating the current and charging our batteries. Let's go check it out. Now the control panel, you can mount um, anywhere you like in your RV. We chose right here in the stairwell. It's a nice convenient spot. Um, as far as the interior exterior lights are here, yeah, we already had the battery cut off down here, so it just seemed like a, a perfect place to put this. I'm trying to block the sun so everybody, so you can see this. Um, this unit is good for uh, lead acid batteries, uh, the absorbed glass mat, the AGMs, uh, even the new lithium iron phosphate batteries, which we upgraded our rig here today with two 75 amp hour lithium batteries. Uh, this can charge two separate battery banks. So uh, we have our two batteries here, that's bank number one. So you could have a totally separate battery bank for auxiliary power or whatever you want uh, and be able to charge both of those at the same time. The display is really nice. It is backlit once you're using it. It'll shut off um, when you're not using it, but it'll show your current voltage. It'll show currently uh, what you're charging your batteries at right now. So right now uh, it is a sunny day out and we're getting 13.1 amps charging our battery bank right now. Uh, it'll also show your battery state of charge. Ours is 100%. Um, and it can show you like a history of how many amp hours that you've been charging. In our case, it was 35. It sat out yesterday and today. So um, neat little display. And again, we're using um, only one battery bank right now. Um, also, if you're planning on in the evening, knowing that you're going to have a lot of usage one one feature I like, it's the max boost feature. You press and hold that for, oh, it looks like five seconds or so, and it will boost the batteries. Uh, so say it's twilight or nearing the end of the day, and you know that you're going to be running a bunch of electric items tonight. This will charge and boost your battery bank just to get you through the night. So this kit is pretty neat. It can install, like I said, if you have a piece of property, you got a cabin that uh, you want to outfit with some power, that's great. Um, another great option for this kit is an RV like this. Now this is a Class C motorhome. You may have a Class A or, or even a van or something like that. It really installs fairly easily. And that was a look at GoPower's Overlander solar panel kit.